briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1870 case of Hover v. Barkhoof, the New York Commission of Appeals focused on the responsibility of public officers receiving compensation from the public for their duties to ensure the safety of travelers. These officers can be held accountable for damages resulting from their failure to repair roads and bridges adequately. The lawsuit arose when highway and bridge maintainers of a town were found at fault for not repairing a bridge, leading to damages. The defendants attempted to argue that they lacked sufficient funds to make repairs, but the court rejected this defense. The law mandated the defendants to maintain the town's highways and bridges in good condition during their tenure in office. In reaching its decision, the court relied on the precedent established in the Adsit v. Brady case and upheld the principle that public officers could be held responsible for damages caused by their neglect or wrongdoing. The judge ruled that the defendants were liable for the damage resulting from their inaction as public officers. The court decisively held that public officials could be held accountable to individuals in a private action when particular damages had been suffered due to the official's negligence. The appeals of the appellants were denied as justice and public policy deemed the court's decision sound. Ultimately, the court ordered the defendants not only liable for damages, but also to pay costs. The ruling affirmed the obligation of commissioners to repair bridges with care and diligence and established their liability for neglect in doing so. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.